What's going on everybody? So I just wanted to take some time and show you around what is quite literally a garage, brewery, now studio, and just a general fun hangout place. This is a really kind of one of our favorite spots just because it serves a good purpose. So we had this space here, so we did a big floating shelf countertop just to uh, help with different parties and things like that, just for serving and just having some counter space here in the, in the area. Of course, I have the TV, got some different signs that we made. Got some old time photos up there that are, that are pretty neat. This area right here, this originally was just some dead space. So this is our chimney area right here. This was supposed to be a cutout, so I walled it off and then made it into a closet. So you have a bar door there. We like the uh, rustic stuff, as you can tell when you see more of this area. So now it hides all of our junk. Here we have, so that's a door into the laundry room. Here we have the extra fridge for some more beer overflow. This way, so this right here, this is kind of dual purpose. And you'll see it when you kind of come around. This is of course a bar top. Got the lights up there to kind of give you some nice ambiance. And then over here, we have pint, pint rack. I really like this shelf because originally this was just some dirty, nasty scrap wood that we salvaged and turned into a pint rack. Got all the mud off of it, and now it's kind of actually one of my favorite things in here. This was some leftover stone from the front of the house. Kind of makes this area pop a little bit more. Of course, we gotta have four beers on draft. You never know what you want, so kind of nice having four different things there for you as well. Behind here, the other side of the bar, this is my brewing area. So, have all my collection of kettles. Have my uh, 240 gallon mash tun and kettle there. Have my anvil uh, foundry brewing system. This is an electric all-in-one system. This makes it very convenient to brew uh, quickly and get things done. Over here we have my mash tun, my old mash tun. I still use it, I love that. That was an old 10 gallon kettle and I wrapped it in some wood, put a ball valve on it, and now you have a mash tun. Got some cool different graphics here. This is the best place to be for brewing. You're, you're behind here, you have the taps ready. If people there are hanging out, you can't, you can't beat it. Last spot I wanna show you guys is this mammoth wall right here. All chalkboard, in case we're gonna write down some workouts. Got the American flags, of course, gotta have those. Got your Betsy Ross, your, your regular American flag, got the all blacked out. And Saturdays are for the boys. Gotta have that. So we plan to do a lot of different cool workouts in the garage brewery. I, I wanted it to literally feel like you're in a gym. Once I have all the equipment up here in a gym inside a brewery, that's that's the barbells and brewery way. So we got the pull-up bar. Um, over here is where I do a lot of the videos and stuff. So cool little uh, whiskey barrel countertop. Barbells and Brews sign. I really love this sign. We had some local guys around here make this. This is uh, from Destination Metal. So a couple really cool, cool guys making some really neat metal designs. Love that, I just got that recently. So thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna see me hanging out in here. And then any of our other content, feel free to check out. The links are in our description box for all social media accounts as well as our bar Barbells and Brews store. So check out that if you wanna get some gear. We will see you guys next time.